I took some time away for a little bit. Following the last reaction that absolutely devastated me, finding out everything about Corazon and sort of Law's origins, it was rough, man. Go watch if you don't believe me. But we're back. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus, and the chaos of Dressrosa continues. We're gonna hop right into it. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a sub. It is never too late. And let's get started. There's some, some oomph behind the hits as if there wasn't already. Dude, wait, the rainbow of, like, Doflamingo's claw? So he can shoot, like, strings, too. Like, tiny strings, I guess. He's actually right. He didn't want to originally. And then Luffy... Will! The Will! Ooh, his, it's, like, permanently changed, like, the, the rainbow. Just, he, he's been appealing to the emotional side of Law. Does Doflamingo still not know about his middle initial, though? That's kind of the question. That's my goat. That's my goat. You can't hurt me anymore. You can't hurt me anymore. Dude! Doflamingo is so scary, man. Dude, meanwhile, Luffy's in almost the worst spot with this 2v1. Although it's not like, I don't think it like equates the power of like Dof uh, the actual Doflamingo. 2v1 still makes it pretty rough. Also, how does Doflamingo like control Bellamy while he's having to deal with Law? Like there's some autonomy to, to like his clones and everything. This is no possible way. Pentachromatic. Yeah, it's like permanently changed to like colorful strings. He won't hurt Bellamy, and he knows that. We're just cutting back and forth and back and forth. What? <laughs> Why is he asking what he thinks of him? Nice! Oh my gosh, it also says, oh! Oh! It says Corazon on his back too. Like I know he's like the heart pirates, but like, yeah, still, it means so much more now. Ooh, he grabbed it. Oh. Godly blood in my veins. Yeah, I don't think he knows about Law's middle initial. Oh! Oh! He told him! Oh, I wonder if that'll like play into Doflamingo's head a little bit. We still don't, yeah, we don't even know how like Kiros and Diamante are going. Oh, there's no way she's breaking it down. Oh, my. Oh, Toei. <laughs> they didn't see it about, like, Frankie and Senor Pink in a while. See, there's, like, too much to check in on. So it's crazy that they spent time doing this. A lot. Like, a lot. I mean, even on just, like, the plateaus, too. Oh, my gosh, bro. What is happening? My brain is melting. There's no way it does that for every single one. No way. Oh, my. This is insane. This is insane. I feel like I'm in, like, the Twilight Zone. <laughs> dude. Dude. The spelling out is crazy. This is insane. This is insane. This is insane. This is insane. <laughs> it's almost funny. Uh, <laughs> it was funny, and then it started doing like everyone, everyone, like Gladius and stuff. <laughs> All right, we're back to the two manly men. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what? Where did that cat come from? What? What's happening? What? Is my brain like combusting? Hard boiled! What the hell just happened? <laughs> Dude, I swear Oda invented Viola and her power in order to recap. Put my tinfoil hat on, bro. She's literally like a narrator incarnate being able to know everything that's happening. 
I like before you couldn't tell the difference between like the the clone and not, and now it looks like it's like a TV screen. I mean, this one isn't even remotely as strong as Doflamingo. Like he's actually getting hits in. The thing is too, if Bellamy dies, like Doflamingo overplays his hand, then like nothing's stopping Luffy. And it'll honestly just make him more mad. Come on, Kiros! Dude, you started so strong, man! Oh no, Diamante's kind of like onto him. Seems like he kind of has his number. Oh. Oh. Did he cut him? <gasps> oh, a face cut! The disrespect! I mean, Diamante was being a little ego, man. I'm like, oh, what's he doing? Is he picking flowers? He's affecting the entire earth? What? 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 Wait, the effect for that looks kind of sick. And it works with the sunflowers. It's like an ocean. It's his battlefield. Army Bandera. What does that, what does that name mean? Ripples like a fire. No, that makes sense. Oh, meanwhile. Oh, my gosh. Bart's still holding it down, baby. a boy and Robin. But like Bart, man. Aw. Robin's like a mom. A mommy. I agree, actually. Robin should go. Bart's got this under control. Rooster. She still calls him Rooster. Wait, or is Bart... Are Bart's stairs gone? Why is she using her legs? I guess he needed to retract it so nobody else could get up and so he could use more barrier. It's like ultimate fanboy's dream. <laughs> is he breaking the fourth wall? Oh, I get it, because when he's asleep. Oh, good one, dude. Wait, who are these individuals on the second level? If only there was some naming sequence. Oh my gosh, man. They're really leaving me in the dark here. Dude, Dellinger just makes me uncomfortable. I'm going to be honest. I feel like the family is a lot stronger than these fighters here. I don't know if I'm underestimating them. Or I'm overestimating the family. I mean, like, bro, Machivise is actually kind of busted. He's so much like that one Baroque Works agent. I forget her name. Is it weird that one of the fights I'm most curious about is, is Senor Pink and Frankie? Oh my gosh. I totally forgot. She's actually falling for him. Come on, Xin Zhao. You cannot lose to Lao G, man. If there's any of these fighters I have a ton of faith in, it's Xin Zhao. But it's because he's like uh, older, more experienced. Oh my gosh, I forgot about Leo. Oh my gosh. Manchetti! Man this fight between Zoro and Pika started like 20 episodes ago and has not progressed since. It's pretty incredible. Oh, he's finally using three. It's, just, it's never gonna end because Pika can just keep swapping the stone. I guess Zoro's got some like the actual damage on him. Oh, Sabo. Oh my gosh. Yo, if Sabo can make it to like the palace, I mean, he's already, he's not all the way on the bottom, like ground level. It would take forever. Like if he could fight with Luffy, that would go crazy. But actually he's the one holding off the Navy, isn't he? But now the Navy isn't moving forward. I don't know. I mean, Law and Doflamingo are kind of talking. Dude, Usopp's like chilling back now. He's done plenty. Law and Doflamingo are talking more than anything. The chromatic the strings go crazy though. Oh, he's mad! Destined to be here. Trouble is... Oh, he's back! Mm. <laughs> A superstition? Then why does that superstition make you so mad? He's got like an, an opening? Dang, bro, he's backseating Doflamingo? <gasps> ah! Damn, is that like a gun? Out of boy law, hell yeah. And you are too, big boy. Corazon. The kind hearted, he couldn't take his own brother down. So that's what he meant by like he's here to do what like what he would have wanted basically. Dude, I'm sorry. I just want to check real quick. How long was that sequence? That was mind boggling. I mean, not to mention we already had like a six minute recap. Okay, wait, wait. Let me see where it starts. That was insane. That was crazy. 944 to like 1240. Three minutes. All right, 708. Let's go. I love the sound effect. <laughs> 
from from that uh injection shot his blade sounding like a gun kind of curious how that even works the trigger what him having the d i can like barely take myself seriously saying like the d he's playing with the man <laughs> trouble just freaking what does trouble do bro actually <laughs> Damn, bro, Don't Flamingo bent that leg. Holy. Oh. No. Oh. Dude, they are, they are going blow for blow here. I'm just going to finally fighting Don't Flamingo. It's sick, man. Oh! The electricity! Dude, how does that even work? Oh. He missed. Trouble. Shut up, man! <laughs> ne <Nah, nah. laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Yo! Dude's actually chirping him. That's crazy. He's trying to like tilt him, I think. Trying to get Law to run it down. Oh! Oh! He's gonna throw. Oh! We see trouble! My gosh! Oh my! Yo! Spider web goes crazy! Doflamingo's getting pushed. Oh my gosh. It's like two of the coolest devil fruits going head to head. What even is the name of Doflamingo's devil fruit? Have we been told it? I don't think so. I guess it's like web web or something or string string. Oh. Oh wait, did, did he say string string? I think he did. He's getting angry. It's not breaking a sweat though. Dude, Bellamy, uh, uh, my mans. How many times is Luffy gonna hit him on accident? Like, bro is on the brink. <laughs> you rat. That's not even him, Luffy. Oh, it speaks? Oh, yeah, it does speak. That's right. It is like basically autonomous. Oh, bro. Bro, poor Bellamy. It's like I'm setting Luffy. Oh. Oh! He interrupted their intimate moment. Oh. Yeah, because you you, you trashed him, bro. What, what was that effect? What is I I don't I don't know about that, man. Oh, we're back to Pika. Boy, they just roll the dice and just pick some up. Oh, he sprouted an entire like new giant. How is Pika not like drained at this point, bro? It's insane. This might be my favorite battle track in the, in the entire show. Oh, I like how whenever it cut through, once it got to his face, the eyes disappeared like Pika shot out of it. That was cool. <laughs> I swear his voice got a tiny bit deeper. Oh, Columbus with the whip. <laughs> Commodore Dignity? What? 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 He can like take over and command them? What is he doing to him? Is he bowling them? What? <laughs> Bro, what is that? Oh my, he said, please don't. I think the only reason that Zoro versus Pika is like way less interesting than all the other fights is because I feel like Pika is so stupidly outmatched because like everything up until this point has been mostly Pika evading Zoro's hits. Oh, and the sheer size of him. Bro's like a Hokage on the mountain. Like what's it gonna take? What was that? Was that a that was a laugh? That was a laugh? It was actually the Hokage. Oh my gosh, it just gets worse. Pika, Pika, Pika. Rose a Pokemon. Charles Stone. Charles Stone. Oh shoot, bro just spikes out? That's kind of cool, actually. It's kind of a cool name for it, too. Charles Stone. He still can't do anything to Zoro, though. Bro, 
Bro says that like he hasn't already like 30 times at this point. Like Zoro was fighting Pika back when we didn't even know who Pika was in the in the castle. Like I said, it's the worst fight here, I think. Oh, Sai versus Baby Five is uh is it Sai or Boo? One of the two. I get them mixed up. Start to the plan. Yep, and let Kaido do it. Mm -hmm. He's literally openly admitting he's like, yeah, it probably would have worked. He was almost like inherently proud of of law for the plan. <laughs> Trouble, what do you think about this man? <laughs> Let's see what what, what was Trouble think? The letter? Letter. Oh, that's right. I'm pretty sure it outlined like the entire Dressrosa plan. He said it would like save a far off kingdom Dressrosa, yeah. Dude, what was he supposed to do as a child? Dude, he's trying to piss him off even more. <laughs> Still just hovering. Hey, he did. I'm just kind of surprised. That's what I was thinking. Is like, no matter what, Dolphamingo is going to take over someplace. Dressrosa was the perfect place because it's a lack of wars, but. Uh, what is he doing? What is he doing? Because Corazon risked his life for law to give law the op op for it. What is he doing? Oh! Did they stumbling down? Oh, damn! He cut his arm off! He can't room. Okay, he could with his other hand. Oh my gosh, bro. Luffy, you need to get up there, little bro. Oh my gosh. I was like, Law and Dovamingo are just like hitting each other back and forth. No, he just cut his entire limb off, man. Oh my gosh. Red Hawk! There you go, Luffy. Stop taking it seriously. Finally, man. He hasn't used that since Horty Jones. I like how in the serious moments he still calls him Mingo. Oh, he's gonna bust them to the ceiling. Dude, oh my gosh. That was gnarly. I think they put a string on him and then like the sheer force just like cut right through like butter. The other deed, Louie. <laughs> oh, 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 there's the gun again. Probably with the, like the lead bullets. Oh. The same gun. Oh, like I said, Louie's... Oh, he's gonna come crashing through. <laughs> Bellamy, it's like, god damn, that straw hat. He's kind of dicking on this Dolphamingo clone. Why is he, why is he execution should, huh? Luffy will crash right through the, oh, or to the sky. Is that the clone? What? Oh, it's destroyed. Lock, quickly, uh, operate on yourself, man. Save the arm. Is it even possible? <laughs> Wait, so the, the, it shut in. So did the clone hit the cage? That's why it, it fell back down, like cut off. Yeah, I guess that would kind of make sense because I don't, I think it was Luffy that tore it apart. I don't know if Luffy could tear it apart, to be honest. Dude, that shot. Oh my gosh. That was like top one shocking moment of this arc so far. That was insane. Like I said, I just thought it was going to do like crazy damage. But my gosh, man, I feel like there's a, there's a two sided thing to the slow pacing because when really, really dire things happen, it catches me so stupidly off guard because I let my guard down. I let my guard down thinking that it's just going to be like another just like sort of throwaway line or them just like, kind of like I said, going back and forth, which I appreciate the back and forth. But then it just obliterates me out of nowhere like that or more specifically Law's arm. But they're going very hard on the entire will of D thing like especially in this arc more so than ever because we've always known about the will of D but it's never really been specified and it still doesn't really make much sense how like there's like a set group of people and they're inherently like enemies of the celestial dragons like did somebody decide this like an almighty power is it sheer luck that someone is bored and like their middle initial is decided from their parents like I just want to know more but it is slowly dripping more and more but guys that has been it for my reaction today I hope you did enjoy. Make sure you drop a like on this one. It does help me out quite a bit. And I'll catch you next time. Peace, peace.